Hey Paul, this is Big Mike with the Bike Exchange. Uh, just making this personal video for you on this motorcycle. And as you can see, I'm gonna do just a couple quick laps. This thing has quite the presence. Um, one thing I'm gonna touch base on with you real quick, because it was one of our topics, is let me get under there. You can see that matching wheel back there. That is a matching 18 um, Glendine wheel that we anodized. Um, Obviously up front you got the G4 30 inch wheel which we anodized of course and the rear 18 which is also anodized and part of the whole system up front that really makes this uh, performance and, and beauty is uh, the six piston caliper up front which is right here it's a brand new six piston HHI caliper uh, very high end caliper great braking uh, fat cats front fender, full wrap fender, um, your uh, forks up front of course are blacked out with your anodized cones there and those are Battistini cones. Uh, right here your turn signals, let me turn this thing on so you can see them, they're the alloy art um, turn signals, small but as you can see they're very uh, very noticeable and your headlight is also a Harley Daymaker headlight, it's very bright. Uh, hence the name Daymaker. I mean, you can see this thing coming on the road from two miles away in, in broad daylight. Um, air ride system, your switch is located right under here. Uh, it's a little toggle switch right here where my finger's at. And that'll release it. And also raise it. Um, let's see. The whole body kit is a Camtech body kit with six inch bags, matching fender, of course. Um, stretch tank and as you can see uh, all of the lines in the paint job are, are all corresponding you know nothing's off everything's balanced uh, all the lines are met up there's a good shot of that neck it's nice and clean man it's smooth um, a lot of guys a lot of shops they put bondo and stuff in there that is all steel there's no bondo in there whatsoever um, our master fabricator like I told you has been doing that stuff for 30 years and uh, he He's a master at his craft, to, to, say, to say the least. Um, your chin spoiler right there is a big mouth chin spoiler. It's a Camtech chin spoiler. Just trying to get some close-up shots here uh, how beautiful this motor is with all these, all these black and anodized parts in there. Um, the, uh, the dash right here on your stretch tank. I'm referring to this right here, this is your dash. That's a Paul Yaffe dash. Um, when to really set these up right to make sure that the headlights actually hit in the road at night, uh, we put a rake bucket in there. Um, this whole setup here is a big aftermarket rake bucket. That way the light's actually pointing at the road. Um, a lot of shops skip stuff like that and your your light's pointing straight up in the air, but this, this is all done right. Um, let's see, and of course your custom Danny Gray seat. The suede, man, it's super soft, really nice. I don't, I don't think the pictures really do that justice. I mean, that's a project in itself. We had to send this out and get all that done, which uh, talking about your tour pack, we could do all that too. Um, some shots of the dash here. I know you were, you were wanting to see that. This is a molded windshield too, by the way. It sits in there nice. Um, but here's your dash. Let me click this thing on your stereo and all that stuff in there and the tack reads 7347 um, we uh, this thing's really set up to ride man um, it's comfy uh, I was one handed down the highway on it at 70 75 miles an hour uh, you can put the cruise on and, and just go got your Focal 6x9s in the back with the Focal tweeters custom lids back there uh, everything up tops all blacked out your levers your bars your mirrors all that stuff as you can see here Battistini tumbler right here for your ignition that's all all the nice stuff all the cables are done in black braided cables uh, your low profile mirrors and once again referring to the motor it has a 107 screaming eagle CNC ported motor uh, it's got 211 Screaming Eagle cams in it. Like I was telling you, all that stuff's all Harley stuff. Um,
It's got uh, the inner cam bearings are done. Um, Rick is our motor builder and he does a lot of those. And when you're doing cams and doing all these high end parts, usually with that much more power added to these motors, the inner cam bearings tend to get beat up. And Rick puts a real high end Torrington inner cam bearing in there to, to compensate for that. You got your, uh, it's got push rods in it. It's got a Power Commander 5 in it. Your exhaust is a big radius Vance and Hines uh, exhaust system. Of course, your, your custom uh, powder coated Battistini floorboards, controls. Um, uh, the stereo does have an amp. It has a 150 watt amp, which pushes all this stuff, which is plenty. Uh, you can hear it going down the road. You can hear it over the motor. Um, it is an amazing bike for a complete loss of words. I mean, this thing's just rad. Uh, anodized Battistini bag latches right there. I'm going to set the camera down for a minute so I can show you the insides of these bags. Everything's carpeted real nice in there. Uh, we've got our custom tethers on there, but both bags are carpeted. Set this back down. Uh, and last but not least, you gotta hear this thing for sure. Throttle super responsive, Paul. Um, it doesn't miss a beat, man. If you you give it some gas and let it eat, man, it goes. Um, if you have any more questions, give me a shout. Other than that, um, I think I'm just as excited as you are to make this video. Uh, we are undoubtedly proud of this thing. Uh, I'm gonna get this video processing for you, and I'll get it over to you here in just a minute. Thanks. Later. Bye.